This is 60 Seconds for Sunday from the monks of St. Benedict's Abbey. Often in the Gospels, we hear of people coming to Jesus in need of healing, crying out to him in boldness and trust. And often we hear those words of Jesus, go, your faith has healed you. But today's Gospel is different. Today it's about a man who is deaf and mute. This man cannot speak for himself, and he cannot hear Jesus' voice. But his friends bring him to Jesus and beg for healing on his behalf. In response, Jesus first touches the man and then says one word, Ephatha, be opened, and he is healed. Perhaps we feel like that man in the gospel, unable to hear God's voice, unable to even ask for healing. Then it is to us that God speaks the words of the first reading. Be strong, fear not. Here is your God. He comes to save you. Jesus comes to save, and he has power to heal us. And this power extends even to those who cannot hear him, who do not know how to ask for healing. Just like he did for the deaf man, Jesus is able to touch us and open our ears and heal us. This gospel presents hope for us in our own deafness and fear, but it also calls us to minister to others who are unable to hear God and who cannot or will not come to him for healing. Like the deaf man's friends in the gospel, we can bring them before Jesus and beg him to heal them. So let us hope in the Lord for our own healing, encourage those who are frightened of heart, and pray for those whose hearts are hardened and unwilling to approach God for healing trusting that our God comes to save and that he does all things well. For more from St. Benedict's Abbey in Atchison, Kansas, see our website, kansasmonks.org.